Hello everyone. Welcome to Knockout City. Uh, I functionally know nothing about this game, but there's a free trial available and it looks kind of fun. So uh, when I say it looks fun, I mean like I saw this image and I saw a couple of screenshots. I think it is ostensibly something like a first person shooter or like arena combat game. Uh, but it's dodgeball themed, which I think is kind of cute. So uh, I thought I would try since it's a free trial. Um, grab a ball to pick it up. Hold left click to charge up your shot. Release to throw. Catch at the right moment with right click. Okay. Don't bother adjusting your dial. Knockout City Pirate Radio has hijacked your airways. I'm your eye in the sky DJ, and I'll be playing only the hottest tunes from my station on the moon. Looks like we got a brand new brawler looking to make a name for themselves. Well, the only way to do that is by winning dodge brawl battles. Before you hit the mean streets, you're gonna wanna log into the radio bot for some in-depth training programs. Or hit up the target dummy to practice your throwing and catching. Don't worry about hurting his feelings none. He loves this stuff. I'll be here playing the tracks while you dish out the wax on your journey to be the best dodge brawler Knockout City has ever seen. Good luck to you, baby. You're gonna need it. Welcome to Knockout City Free Trial. Enjoy this limited trial up to street rank 25 and invite your friends to dominate your rivals in street play. Okay. Pretty standard, pretty standard. Okay, that's new. Control is some kind of dodge dash thing. Space is jumps, shift is sprint. Uh, okay. Our mouse sensitivity is kind of low, but, or, or, or it's kind of high, but I, I don't mind it. Uh, so I, I, I'm not gonna turn this into a series, but you know, uh, it, it's free and it's a little bit different and I thought to myself like why not do something a little bit different Okay, I don't have a double jump. I just have the the paraglider Is that a jumping point? No, it's just a grill But it had a highlight on it like the other thing pick up a ball Okay Seems like there's some amount of auto lock on. Uh, oh, there is a double jump, but it's not space twice. It's space E or space Q. Q is some kind of flip, E is a spin. I don't know what those will do differently. I guess what we'll see. Um, hello, let's go to training. I said, I, I don't think this will be a series, but it, it seems like it could be fun. I, I haven't played this kind of like online battle situation in a while. Uh, but, you know, I, I always kind of liked picking up these games and, and playing them the just a little. Rolling, there's no place better than rooftop rumble. Learning how to run and jump across these rooftops could mean the difference between supreme victory and sudden vertigo. Find every radio bot scattered around the rooftops to learn all the core skills any brawler worth their salt will need to master. Mm -hmm. Hope you aren't afraid of hides. Space to jump. Pretty standard. This is very basic. But yeah, there, there was a minute where I was actually kind of into you can't dodge brawl without balls. Walk into balls to pick them up. Press G to drop. Okay, so there is actually a Don't look down, baby. drop mechanic. Uh, what a tranquil but I can pick it back up. I wouldn't linger too long. You're technically trespassing. Yep. Catch with that. 
stand in the circle in front of the target dummy to initiate its throw catch protocol. Oh, too late. So timing is pretty specific. It's not horrible, but when an opponent locks onto you, you'll see a border warning around the screen. The border warning will also show you the direction of the opponent. If they are off screen, it will change the state when ball is thrown. Try going back to stand in the circle and turn in different directions. Okay. Can I catch? Okay, I do have to be facing it. Unsurprisingly. Too late. Okay, so, and you can also, they can collide midair, good to know. I presume there's some amount of power up if you do get that perfect catch, because it looks like the ball's imbued with power. Use space to glide. Yep. Not surprising. That multi-millionaire Malcolm Magpie has been buying up huge chunks of the city. Says he's gonna revitalize the place. high wind with the old and into the new, I guess. for gliding. If you ask me, that kind of talk speed. Is for the birds. Cute. Need a ball designation. Bye bye. Once you found all the bots, you're free to move on to the next training. Okay. Uh, next. Hey, all right. You completed all the lessons and basic training. Let's try a more advanced one then, shall we? Welcome to Concussion Yard. A great place to learn how to be the ball. Looks like someone Follow forgot to turn off the machines. Be on the lookout for new and paths and watch out for the Give wrecking ball. High speed wrecking ball. Okay, and you can catch while gliding, or you can grab while gliding. Hold left alt to go into ball form. Very weird. I have no idea what they're building here. Luxury apartments. This is office space. bizarre. Whatever it is, it's certainly out of my price range. You can pick up and throw other ball form players, like a normal ball thrown players cause an instant KO. Uh okay, that was unexpected. Oh, is there any wet cement to write your name in? I used to love doing that. If they hit. Oh, okay, so it's not you don't throw like a regular ball. Uh, okay, weird. While in ball form, opponents can pick you up too. You'll be locked in their hands and have to hold space to escape. Mash space to break out faster. Okay. Oh no! Okay. You can also be thrown. Okay, well, I don't know why that went straight when I threw the other guy straight up, but whatever. We'll see. Hold to roll into your and try ultimate throw. When fully charged, you'll be thrown high into the air. Okay. Okay, so that's what happened. I, I fully charged. Which... Okay. We tried to save the school. Even had a fundraiser right here on the station. But there's not much a bunch of brawlers Mag can poop. do against the mega it says on the wall of there. Malcolm Magpie. How? Oh, Malcolm Mag... Ball form opponents can pick you up too. That I already saw. What is... Wait, what does this guy say? Emotes. Press while in ball form to say throw me. Okay. 
Uh, okay, so we have kind of like a Splatoon style anti corporate message thing going Go on. Get hit by that wrecking ball. No. It won't knock you out, but it will knock you around. <laughs> you can also throw a teammate. Yeah, I, I did that the first time. Claim the high ground for a strategic advantage. Use your laser to get the drop on other brawlers from above. Okay. Uh, be on the lookout for special balls that appear randomly from ball spawners. This one is the moon ball. While holding it, you'll jump like you would on the moon. Hitting someone with it will send them to space. Cute. Just completed the last training lesson in this section. Why not jump into a match and practice what you learn? Oh yeah, they get launched. Choose where to go next. As the saying goes, ball up or shut Okay, so that does do a spin. If I that does a high throw, it looks like. Q does a high throw, E does some kind of like spin depending on if I'm going left or right. Okay. Okay. Next training. Presumably advance. Advance training. But yeah, I did... Um, I don't know. I, I, I would play these online shooters now and again. I was never very good at them, but like I, I would pick them up, um, kind of plow through the early levels, like kind of in, the, in that zone where... You'd still be leveling up every session. In this training, we'll teach you everything you need to know about overcharge. Overcharge makes the ball go faster than just a normal charge. You get overcharge in two ways. Receiving a pass or perfect catching an incoming throw. This roundabout's always busy, so you got to watch out for traffic. The cars will knock you away when they hit you, but they don't hurt. Jump on top of them for a free ride. Didn't your mama Hop. ever tell you not to play in traffic? <laughs> yeah, mine neither. Hold. Okay, middle mouse for for pass. Any enemies to throw it at? No. Okay, well, I'm gonna... Okay, it does ramp down. It's not permanent. When you have four or more tiers of overcharge, the ball becomes supercharged. It's crazy fast, but you can only get supercharged from a perfect catch. Supercharge caps out of tier six. Remember... You gotta stand in the circle in if you time catch the perfectly, you'll overcharge the ball and fa recover faster. Balls. Press the last possible moment. Yeah. Nope, too late. I did these before. Too late. How do I see where... Good, but not perfect. Perfect. Okay. I wonder if it's per life or what? Or in between hits? I don't know. Let's go to the next computer. This is a multi-ball. Three balls for the price of one. These balls will disappear quickly after being thrown. Whenever somebody grabs a multi-ball, the whole map will hear about it. Oh. Dangerous. If you can't receive a pass, you're already holding the ball. Instead, the pass will be reflected back towards the original thrower. Press to pass to a teammate holding a ball and reflect it back for a quick tier one overcharge. Don't forget, you can pass to nearby teammates even when you're not looking at them. Oh. Oh, nice. Here. 
cool. Okay, so the overcharges do seem to be powerful in their own regard. When you pass to a teammate, you'll give them a heads up by shouting here. Press blank when your hands are empty to call for a pass instead. Yeah. Uh, where's a teammate? Where I can call call for a pass. Pass to me! Maybe not. This is a sniper ball, absolute beast at long range combat. Hold to lock. Keep for a full lock. Throw a blindingly flash shot. Okay. Where? Where's a That's the last training lesson in this section. Where's a guy? I recommend jumping into a match while the lessons are still fresh in your mind. Where's a guy? Open the menu to choose where to go next. I want to snipe Show first. How much of a speed demon you really are. Okay. Escape. There's more training maybe. Let's let's actually just play a match. Let's see how this goes. But yeah, I I played like 10 or 15 hours of uh, Battlefield 3 and Battlefield 4. I like her leather jacket with the yellow, the yellow fringe. They've got contrast, but I, I like the, I like piped edges on jackets to begin with and, and yellow piping is super good. Um, Hmm. We're in a match lobby. Blue team takes the lead. Why can't I? We're in the match lobby. Mute yourself, just so people don't hear me doing this. Why am I not in a game? Blue team is pulling way ahead. No inventory, no XP boosts. Uh, I don't know why I'm not seeing gameplay. I was stuck in a menu as far as I could tell, unless there was a prompt. Um, hollow bucks. I, I presume, like, I, I believe this is sort of a budget title. Um, I think it's like 20, maybe 20 bucks for the, the full game. Not 100% certain about that, but, uh, go to training. No, play a match. Hopefully it works this time. Maybe there's some issue. Connecting to Team KO. Waiting for players. Okay, this seems more... Right. Hopefully no one... On the is, there's an epic dodge screen slurs the or something. I don't city. usually record multiplayer. The crown, looks like a clown. Bomb ball. Don't know what that does, but it sounds powerful. Cool. Subject Goochlet and DJ Flicky. They seem like good guys. And ooh, they seem very powerful. Oh, hi David. Oh, they know me. Cute. Team KO. Round one. Pass to me. Knock out more opponents than the other team to win. Pass to me. Takes the lead. Oh, fuck. Didn't realize that that was gonna happen. Never used a bomb ball. Good to know, I guess. Wish I had done that tutorial. Woohoo! 
Gotta find a target. Okay, I think I'm doing okay. I saw Hi David go down there. Oh. Okay, I think we're... I think they've kind of given up. I can't find them. Where are the enemies? Oh, maybe they have given up? Connected, maybe. Nope. Gold team needs one more point to win the round. Oof, there is a bomb. Gold team wins. Ten to three. Okay, not bad. Yeah, I played Battlefield three, I played Battlefield four. Four. I got those super cheap, like five dollars each or something at one point. Um, I'm trying to think. Go Gotham City, something or other. It, it was like um, a tiered first-person shooter. Uh, set in Gotham City. Gotham City. Something. I can't remember for the life of me what. Blue team takes the lead. I see one of them. Where'd they go? Why would you throw me in the... You threw me in the garbage. How weird. Gold team takes the lead. Uh, thank you. It's all tied up. Four to four. Oof, bomb. Oof, double hit. Blue team takes the lead. Rough. Catching is going to be hard. Like, knowing where someone is approaching from. I'm, I'm kind of into this, though. It's all tied up. Nice. Gold team takes the lead. Well, I think I helped. I'm doing okay. Can't remember for the life of me what the name of that Gotham City game was, though. Nice. And I got that one myself. 
I think I helped. I think I did good. Oscar Trash and Sneaky on no. Oh, blue team. I guess Hi David left. Well, I do like my team. Such a good chillet. You the MVP. Thank you, buddy. How much we get? Rounds one, rounds complete. Ooh, 11 eliminations. Out of tw I don't know why, well, hmm. I guess I don't know. It might be the Overwatch thing where an elim includes anyone that you helped eliminate. Level up, cool. Not loving those gloves, but okay. What do we got? I'm okay with those. I could rock those with this jacket. Um, yeah. I don't really want these, but why not? Um, uh, menu. Turn to hideout. Can I customize my my player? Uh, standard or deluxe? Okay, yeah, dude, it's a $20 budget game. Gotham City... Oh, man, it's killing me. I, I don't want to look on my computer yet, though. Because uh, I, I want to think of it on my own, if possible. Go to settings for Customize brawler, options. please. Use the social bar at the top of the Player to icon. And always remember to open uh, contracts to view today's challenges before you play. Let's do a heart. That seems nice. Uh, Here's a fashion tip. Most outfits and gloves can be hacked with style chips to unlock fresh new styles. Check so them this out is it. Them all. I, th I think this is mostly what I'm about. Oh, I do want to unlock those, though. Uh, I don't have any style chips, though. Any deets. That's a cool detail. You can change body type. Uh, I'll go hair darker. You know what? No, I can't. Well, I don't know. They're nice. They look good. Um. Okay, there's some decent, kind of nice options here in terms of. Uh, ooh, powerful eyebrows. Yes, thank you. I don't know if we can actually get cinnamon makeup. We do yellow makeup. Uh, ooh, no, that doesn't work. Let's go back to cinnamon. Thank you. Hair. We we have kind of got really thick cornrows going into what I I guess I was originally interpreting as like bantu knots, but uh, not so much. Uh, are these all the hairstyles? Only ten of them. Uh, well, I'll stick with that. Uh, maybe make it darker brown. Uh, actually, you know what? I kind of like the red brown. No, let's stick with it. Wine. Yeah, let's stick with it. Uh, hmm. Contrast is a little better now that I have the powerful eyebrows. Um, that fits with the glasses better, too. Glider... Hello. What's up? How you doing? Hello. How do? How do ho? Oh, it's very powerful, but doesn't fit my design, I don't think. Sure. Woohoo! Uh. Okay, lots of unlockables. I suspect, like a lot of these games. But like a lot of these games, this is, I don't know, kind of how it's going to make the money. League play. I presume I have to have the paid version of the game in order to, to do that. Uh, rank 5 to get Ball Up Brawl. Actually, it's just a bunch of, a bunch of playlists. Or a few of them. Uh, let's let's do another match. I, I, I said I don't think I'm gonna like. This isn't gonna be a series 
Um, I, I don't care that much. We got MDW 13 TS, SPC Morris 90, and we're gonna face off against Maximum Gamer. Racing crew, we're, we're still waiting on somebody. They're, they're down a person, unless that person has a blank don't username. I, I don't know if that's possible. This is all through EA Origin, so I maybe... I don't know. Cage ball, it's that... I don't know what that does. Gold team, ooh. Ooh, that's a problem. Matchmaking might need some work. Slightly better players involved here. Let's get across the map and get some distance. Let's see what this buy does. Blue team takes the lead. Lovely. Okay. I feel like I really carried something there. I did a lot, I should say. I didn't carry, but like, I helped. Too late. That's on me. I'm getting the rhythm of it though, and I, I do actually kind of like the pace of this game uh, more than most first person shooters, I guess. Oh, down. Dang, they're up too. Map size is maybe proving to be an issue. Assist. No ball. Where's ball? Ball. Gold team takes the lead. Dang it. That was all me. Ooh, curve. Blue 
team takes the lead. Nice. Oh. Oh no. Round four. Blue team. Ball, 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 ball. Thirty seconds remaining. Nice. Okay, I think that's good. I think I'm also a little bit more aware of the importance of passing than, than my teammates in that case. Though we are getting issues with people dropping games. I wonder if that is... Oh, no, no, blank, blank boy. I think blank... No, I, I don't know. I don't know if we're losing somebody or if that's a blank username. Where's ball? There's ball. It's all tied up. Thank you. Goal team takes the lead. Ow. Oof, that's on me. I was, that was bad positioning. My team, though, I feel like isn't picking up on the pass strategy. Helped there. Ball, 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 ball. Ball's life. Nice, 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 nice. There is kind of a, um, there is kind of a dog piling thing going on. Is that a loss of points, or does it give them one? There's that cage ball again. Far throws are actually kind of dangerous, and since they're not really skill shots, they are uh, more liability than anything. Oh! Oh, down I go. Gold team takes the lead. That's on me again. I'm not helping the team in this one. I also maybe don't understand this it's map great. Oh, nice. Catching up.
Ooh. Clever. Okay, they got a double KO by throwing one of their own teammates. Very clever. Okay, fun fun round. We'll, we'll probably just close this one out and that'll kind of be the end of my, my let's try. But it, it, it's kind of nice to... I, I might play more of it. I mean... I'm having fun. Don't go off the cliff. Thank you. Dang it. Ow. Gold team takes the lead. Oof. My team is not getting the uh, teamwork bit. Not great. Ball. I guess I could throw them off cliffs, which I think is the point. Ow. Point of cage ball, I guess, is maybe to throw people off cliffs, which I haven't done yet. So I'll, I'll try to do that before the end of the match. Got him in a ball, at least. Throw him off cliff. Nice. Assist. I'm helping a little. Not as much as I should be. Ow. Ow. I'm really screwing up this round. Ow! Racing Crew knows his stuff. Oof, they're really running away with it now. Ow. I don't know if I can catch catch an enemy. Is there a... I don't know if there's an in-game uh, score checker. Lost two to three. I mean, I guess on the one hand, they also had more targets to hit, but that, that was still kind of embarrassing. 
Let's see how much we get. 16 eliminations. I mean, that's still not, I guess, I guess a lot, but... High five. Lots of XP rewards for completing optional challenges. 3,000 XP, 4,000 XP, dang. That's a lot. I'm gonna rank up at least a six, I think. Maybe five. Don't really want a baseball cap. Faded goatee. Okay. Wow, really ranking up fast. This is, again, like, part of the the way that I play these games, though. Like I said, when, when I take on, um... Huh. Intrapose, cool. Uh, no thank you to either of those. Let's go back to main menu. Uh... Turn to hideout. I would actually just like to quit the menu, but I, I don't think that that was an option. When I play these games, I said whether it was any of those first-person shooters, or there have been others uh, that are even less memorable. There's that one, is it called Loadout on Steam? Where you could, like, kind of build custom weapons, sort of. Uh... Let's customize our brawler. I do like this outfit. Let's change the style, though. I do like the polka dot pants a lot. The all black is very powerful, though. And I actually like the... Oh, man, the pink rolled cuffs are nice. I'm kind of into all of them. Um, th this plays nicest with both blue and yellow team, though. So let's, let's go for it. Uh style. Okay. Well, cute. Uh, I should also see what are some other styles we got. I like that. I would, I would probably wear that in real life. White pants I don't do that much, but it's not a bad idea. Uh, no, I don't want to equip it, but I just wanted to see. Uh, I'm into the white-yellow contrasts. Those are good. Uh, this, not so much. No, we'll go back here. Anyway, thanks so much for watching, uh, everybody. I, I hope you enjoyed this um, blind introduction to the game. Uh, I, I, yeah, I presume that there's quite a lot of ranks. Okay. Each brawler gets them in a random order. But oh. don't worry, baby. You'll learn them all by the time you reach max rank. Random order is kind of an interesting concept. It, it, that actually helps give... I don't know. That, that could be the kind of thing that Fall Guys looks at. I guess Fall Guys is another one of these, even though it's not like a first-person shooter or whatever. But there, there's quite a few of these games that have the ranked progression, and I, I, I'm not in love with these games that are... Typically trying to encourage people to spend microtransaction money. Um, Use the hollow books you earn to buy exclusive. And yeah, the, the like the, the nature of showing off only and won't affect your abilities. Looking the best ooh, does not I do like that. mean you'll play the best. You dig? The brawl um, shop changes daily, so check back often to see what's in stock. That's very powerful. Um Ooh, also very powerful. 500, I presume? I can't actually see. Yeah, 500. Okay. Um, you know, I hope you enjoyed this. You know, obviously, if you want to try this out, I, I like it. It has a, a shooter-esque vibe, but I, it's it's not really frantic the way that shooters are. Um, I don't know. I, I, I kind of am into this. I might play it more on my own, and maybe, I don't know. If, if I play all the way up to rank 25... Or, or get close to rank 25 if I even play more I, I don't know if I will but if I play more um, you know I, I will mm, 
I, I might do a follow-up video just to give you more impressions of, of what it means to have like put more time into the game. Um, but it's free. If, if you liked this, check it out on Steam. It's, it's free. Uh, and e even if you want to buy the paid version to uncap it, it's only 20 bucks, which is not bad. Uh, obviously, they're trying to incentivize you to spend more money on the microtransactions or whatever to, you know, fear of missing out or whatever. But it, it, I don't know. It's, it's um, I, I kind of enjoy playing one of these things once in a while. Like, it is ultimately just like Skinner Box, um, you know, give yourself a bunch of rewards. And that's kind of maybe not the best thing, but I don't know. We, we can talk about that in other videos or maybe not because I don't really like talking about it or like other people have said a lot more about it. So uh, thanks so much for watching, everybody. We'll, we'll see you next video. Some, some other thing.